guys, this is EKB News Reporter Shelby Porter here at Velocity Market in Pikeville. I'm standing here with Paul Maynard, Public Safety Director for Pikeville. This is a very unusual scene. We don't really see this very often. Paul's going to kind of tell us a little bit about what happened. Uh, basically, we, we had an elderly female driver. She pulled up to Velocity where the front doors are, and, and, and from what we're gathering, that she she actually uh, made a mistake, hit the gas pedal instead of the brake, and, and she actually struck the building and, and, and made entry into the building. Uh, there was a cashier on the other side of the wall. Uh, initial reports was that she was possibly trapped. However, when we got here, she was not. Uh, we did some uh, uh, initial, uh, uh, I guess, investigation, and that's how we determined it, that she had actually hit the gas instead of the brake. Uh, right now, we, we did transport the cashier just as a precautionary matter. Cautionary matter, and uh, the driver's not being transported. So we're working with Velocity and the fire department, EMS, and police to get this vehicle out of here and hopefully get them back operating as soon as possible. So right now, Velocity Market is obviously closed. Absolutely. You guys are working together in order to get it back up, up and running. No major injuries at that we know of right now right now i'm not I think sure she, how the cashier yeah, is she she was transported as a precautionary uh, i'm not really for sure what the injuries were before uh, but uh, luckily she wasn't trapped as initially reported but we do know that it's not life-threatening uh, as far as i can tell as far as we know it's not life-threatening at this time we will keep you updated um traffic right now is okay nothing's blocked just velocity market is closed but we're working to get that open as you can tell behind us, they're moving the car. So I'm going to kind of let you see the scene a little bit. Just the front of the building, you can see the window right at this time. So we'll keep you updated here on EKB News and we'll have um, a full report on the EKB Evening News at 6.